On today's ChurchTechCast.com screencast show, Finding Your Mouse in ProPresenter 6. Hi, and welcome again to another episode of the ChurchTechCast.com screencast show. This is the show where every week I help you with the software that we use in the church. My name is Paul Allen Clifford, and I'm your host. I'd love for you to ask your questions, so just do that below the video. So this is not a huge pressing problem, except when it is. And that is that you're working along, and you lose your mouse, and you can't figure out where it is. Is it on the stage display? Is it on the main display? You just don't know. So let's head over to my computer and we'll uh, take a look at the solution for this problem in ProPresenter 6. It's not a big deal except when it is and sometimes that's huge. So right now you see my mouse. Well let's imagine that I'm in a Sunday service, let's say that we're in this, I'm going through these things, and someone distracts me, and I move my mouse, I turn in, I talk to them, and then for the life of me, I cannot find my mouse. I move over, nothing. I move over the other side, nothing. It is nowhere to be found. I don't know if it's on the stage display, or if it's on the main display, and depending on my settings, it might be hidden underneath those main windows. So how do I find it? Well, it's really simple. You go to Alt or Option M. See that? Popped it right in the middle of the screen. So if you don't remember that, that's okay because it's right here. Find my mouse. Now, if you don't know where your mouse is, that doesn't help you because you, you can't find your mouse if you don't. But if you tend to lose your mouse, you might want to, before service, every time, just go into help and go, okay, it's Option or Alt M for mouse. Alt M mouse. Option M mouse. I want the option to find my mouse. So, not a huge thing, not something that is life or death, except when it is. And so, I just wanted to do a quick show just to talk about that one feature, finding your mouse. Well, I hope that helped you. I hope that now you will know where to look to get the command, should you forget it, and you know what the command is and where to look for your mouse to show up. Um, if you like this content, you'll like my email newsletter, so by all means, head over to trinitydigitalmedia.com slash gifts, G-I-F-T-S, and there you can pick up some church tech gifts and a free subscription to my email newsletter where I give you even more tips and tricks and tell you about the great stuff that's happening here at trinitydigitalmedia.com, including something I found out about today that I'm not allowed to talk about just yet, but soon, soon. Uh, so uh, go over there. Also head over to my store where I've been busy releasing new products, things that are helpful for you as a church techie, because I'm a church techie. And so I think, okay, what could help me? And then I make it. So that's why I've done that, and I think that you'll find a lot of useful stuff over there, whether it's training or actually some technology that will help you. Until next time, this is Paul Allen Clubbard with TrinityDigitalMedia.com. Go out and change eternity.